I don't think anyone expects to see anything like that, but you know, it feels sad for the family. At 5.30 on Friday morning, Wilma Copley was drinking coffee and reading a book when she heard a commotion outside. She could hardly believe what she saw outside her front door. I just saw someone lying in the street. It was right in, in front. And um, when I saw the man come out and was crying, and um, I was pretty sure it was my neighbor next door. The body in the street was Wilma's neighbor, 45-year-old Ivana Olson. Homicide Sergeant Dave Walker says Olson was warming up her minivan in her driveway. When she came outside, she caught someone trying to steal it and tried to stop them. How she tried to prevent it, we really don't know at this point. At least I don't know. She jumped in the van or jumped on top of the van. Uh, the people that were stealing the van obviously continued with that theft, uh, sped away, knocking her off and underneath the van. Uh, she was run over at that point and killed. Olson's van was found at the Sandy Park Apartments soon after. Olson worked for Tulsa Public Schools since 1997. She started as a custodian and worked her way up to a supervisor in the laundry department. I am told that she just really loved her, loved her job and loved her uh, children and and uh, grandchildren. So a lot of, uh, I think, a lot of good memories of her. We spoke by phone with Olson's former father-in-law. He says Ivana worked hard for everything she had. He's not surprised that she wouldn't give up her property without a fight. Dug on it. It's not worth a, a human life uh, over a, a minivan. Uh, I know it's important to you at that time, and, and emotions run high at that point, but uh, by golly, there, there's a family now missing somebody, and that, that's not good.